I'm looking forward to having lots of fun with my friends because everyone on this team has a very close bond. And I'm also looking forward to the chance of going to state because I never would have thought that would ever be like a possibility at all. Some of my goals are that I'd really like to get a personal best this year in my 5K time. And I also would like to hopefully have our team go to state. Um, it, it really means a lot to me. I'm gonna be uh, a leader and I really hope that I can be an inspiration for first years and everybody else. Uh, to be a leader and uh, put in the most effort that I can for each practice and to uh, show everybody else uh, that they can put in the effort too. My goal personally this year is to break 17 minutes and that should set us uh, up for going to state this year. I think we're going to be a pretty spectacular team just based on visually what it looked like at, at, uh, at our own home meet last Friday where you saw packs of twos and threes up front in the top 15, both boys and girls. That's pretty impressive. I originally started because of my dad. He runs marathons and so I decided that it would be fun to join cross country in seventh grade and I, I really liked it and I found that it was something I was good at and I could improve on and I had a lot of friends that I made and it was a great atmosphere. I was doing Nordic skiing in the winter and once I finally um, realized that a lot of me, my other friends on the team were doing uh, track and cross country, I eventually decided to do it myself. Um, and I stay in the sport because I really like the community-based um, activities and the, um, the racing atmosphere and the support that comes with this uh, large and great community. Girls team, I'm going to say the depth, one through ten, it's the deepest team we've had as far as high-end quality. Uh, and uh, not a lot of separation between numbers one through seven. Well, even, even that, based on performances on Friday, one through 12 is pretty tight. I think we were like one minute, under one minute between our number one and number five from their finish times. So that was, that's phenomenal. And on the boys' side, I think the other teams are gonna have less expectations of us. We're gonna have higher expectations of, of our performance, and that showed we, we were third on Friday. Uh, competing against a strong Hopkins team and, and an Orono team, which uh, should be, well, close to being ranked. So uh, I think we're going to surprise a lot of people.